I am running late, so my vlog camera is quickly charging while I make breakfast. Um, I am using my phone to vlog right now, but I'm headed downtown. I'm going to go get a blowout done to my hair. So I did my makeup. I left my hair as is. Um, I was contacted by a rep from Dyson to go and get a blowout done and learn more about their blow dryer. And I don't know if you guys have seen the videos on YouTube about the Dyson blow dryer. I know I have. I've been watching them for a while now, and I've been wanting this Dyson blow dryer forever, but the price tag on it is ridiculous. And I was like, okay, like... I don't know, do I want to spend that much on a blow dryer? But since they contacted me, I was like, hey, it's like meant to be. I've been wanting this blow dryer forever. So I'm going to go learn more about this blow dryer and get my hair did. Quickly got to eat breakfast. I have to be there at 1. It's, gonna, it's not going to take me long to get there, but, you know, my dad's driving me because I don't want to look for parking downtown. That always wastes time. Don't know how I'm getting home yet, but we shall figure it out. So see you guys when I get there. just left my appointment and I don't know how I'm gonna get home my dad dropped me off but I might cab it home I don't not in the mood to take the sea bus but yeah I caught my own Dyson so excited to use this like I want to make sure my hair looks like this I'm gonna try um, I had no idea you could like do curls with a round blow brush but um, I'm really hungry I think I'm gonna have a sugar cookie for lunch now um, yeah on the hunt to find a cab. I don't see any. Did you guys know that Uber's coming to Vancouver, but not until like end of the year? I really wish there was Uber right now so I could Uber home. Do you guys see all this? I'm about to do an unboxing and a haul for you. Some of the stuff was sent to me and some of it I purchased myself. So let's start. So obviously the first thing I'm gonna start with is this Dyson Supersonic blow dryer, which they gifted me at the event today. Thank you so much. I've always wanted one of these. I watched Graveyard Girl's um, YouTube review on this blow dryer when she tried it. It actually retails for $500 Canadian, which is a little ridiculous, the price on here. But after having my hair done today, like, if this is what my hair is going to look like, then this might just be worth it. Did you guys notice my Dyson's pink? Like my pink vlog camera I used to have that's like dead now, but I like pink electronics. Um, I'm sitting in my room. As you guys can see, my bedspread right now is the purple and silver theme, which I showed you guys when I first redid my room. But I actually am changing up. Oh, what did I just say? Oh, it's just my tripod. I am changing up my theme for my room today to like a baby blue for the spring and summer. So let me show you guys. This is what it's going to look like. So I'm going to need some help putting this on my bed because I can't put this duvet cover on the duvet all by myself. So once my dad or my mom is home, I'll get them to help me and I'll show you guys what it looks like after. The camera's not really picking up the color in the picture, but it is a baby blue. I got the matching pillows. I even got like a navy blue little blanket thing. I had a purple one before. So I'm excited to change this out for this. I'm going to be redoing some other things. I have like a Pinterest project that I'm going to do like along here with like Instax minis. Um, I was gifted an Instax mini printer for Valentine's Day from Bay. So uh, I'll show you guys that later. I'll talk about that after. But let's get to the haul. Have you guys ever ordered stuff on eBay? Well, I ordered clip-on bangs just because I was curious and, you know, it's fun. They were, like, really cheap. I ordered this at the beginning of December. Today is March 8th. It just came in the mail. I had even filed a report on this, and they refunded me my money, and, well, it's here now. I'll try these on later for you. So this package was sent to me, and I love how it says, To Queen Mona Sanga. 
so awesome. Let's open it up and see what's inside. These silicone beauty sponges just came out of that package. I've seen so many videos on YouTube of like beauty girls using these and now I have one. It feels so weird. I'm so interested to know how this applies foundation. So this one is this kind of a shape and then this one is like a teardrop shape. And then there's a note and these are from Angela who owns Beauty Call. So it says Timona sending you these cute Beauty Call blenders. Try them out. Let me know what you think. Angela. Thank you, Angela. So a company called Sat Yuga Life sent me body butters and it looks like the owner's name is Seema. And there is a note. It says, Dear Mona, I hope you enjoy these healing body butters. All ingredients are organic, natural, and vegan. Very hydrating, nourishing, and soothing. Perfect for your sensitive skin. Love and light, Seema. And then it says, FYI, products melt in high temperatures. Okay, well, I won't be storing this in high temperatures. And I do have sensitive skin. I usually get an allergic reaction to products that are scented. Not all, but most. Like, I can't try... Um, a lot of perfumes, I actually don't even own any perfumes because they usually just, I break out in a rash. Um, and then same from like hand sanitizers, certain hand sanitizers, if I use it, like my hands get so itchy and red, there's only like certain products that I actually can use. I'm actually looking forward to trying these. Let's smell it. So this one is Decadent Bliss and this one is Tranquility. what it looks like this smells like it kind of smells like oh my gosh like after eight those like mint chocolates mmm decadent bliss it smells like after eight and laundry mixed together but I like it oh these are very hydrating I don't know if you can see, but they're almost like rubbing like an oil onto yourself. This one is from Sahi Cosmetics. This one has a note. It says, Hi Mona, we are so excited for you to review our products. We want Sahi girls all over the world to have products that work for their skin. So enjoy the goodies and hashtag own your color. XOXO Shelly Sahi. This company emailed me and they said that they specialize in cosmetics that are meant for girls of color. So Indian girls, this might be something that interests you if you have a hard time finding products that fit your skin color. So what is in here? Waterproof matte liquid lipsticks. Ooh, I love my liquid lipsticks. You guys know I only wear liquid lipsticks. Like I have not worn a regular lipstick in forever. So as I was taking the liquid lipstick out of the packaging, it fell right there and now it's under my bed because I'm sitting on the edge of my bed. But it was a red color. Oh, this, I really, it's actually stuck like under my bed. I'm going to have to like use like the end of a broom to get that out. But it is like a red color from what it looks like because this is what they sent me. Um, and then this is a contour and baking palette. Oh, so there's cream products on the top row and powder right here. Cool. So the stuff I just showed was stuff that like company sent me to try, but this is stuff that I purchased all myself. And guys, I ordered the glow kit by Nicole Guerrero. So I always see Dress Your Face talking about these eyeshadows on her Snapchat. They are the Natasha Denona ones. And these eyeshadows are a little bit pricey, but they always look so amazing and pigmented when she swatches them. So I was at Sephora the other day with Sarah and they actually had these two palettes in the store. And I was like, oh, I didn't know they had these. The only reason I bought this one is for that gold shade. Wait till I swatch it. And then this one is more shades that I would actually use. Let me just put the flash on from my phone so you guys can see what I'm talking about. Do you guys see that? There's like specks of gold eyeshadow. Look at it on my finger and then on my hand. Prettiest gold eyeshadow I've ever seen. So I'm going to insert some of my Snapchats that I took when I 
swatch this on my hand because the flash with the snap just did more justice to the colors. I have two. I got one for myself and one for Syrah. Here it is. So the tones of the highlighters and the glow kit are actually pretty like rose gold copperish, which they looked a little bit more gold online, but I don't mind. I mean, I like to have variety in my makeup kit, so I'm still going to use these and play around with them. I'm also looking to trying a new foundation, so I picked up the Hourglass Seamless Finish Foundation Stick. And for those of you wondering, I got the shade Buff. It was really hard for me to find my shade. This was the closest one. It might be a little off, but I won't know till I actually try it on my whole face. From Stila, I picked up a eyeshadow in the shade Kitten. And this is my favorite eyeshadow to highlight my inner corner and my brow bone. So whenever you see me with makeup on and I have a shimmery inner corner or brow bone, this is what I use. I've gone through two others of these. This is my third one. I love this thing. And from Bobbi Brown, I got a blush. And I saw someone using this in a YouTube tutorial. And it looked like a pretty color. So I got myself one. It is in the shade Sand Pink. So I was thinking what if I got a P.O. box where you guys can send me mail like I love receiving handwritten letters so I think that would be really fun and that way companies that want to send me stuff can just send it there and the address will be like in the description box of my videos so I'm thinking of doing that because right now I've been receiving a lot of emails from companies that want to send me stuff or like their products to try out and I've been giving like my personal address or my American mailbox that I have over the border and sometimes it's just a little hard with replying back to everyone and you know just giving everybody a fair chance to be able to send me their stuff so I think this will be the easiest way what do you guys think like leave me a comment down below oh my god these bangs are horrible these are a joke hi friends hello hi Manny <laughs> guys she's gonna be our sober woman today she's our DD. she's our DD that means we're gonna get turned in Abbotsford. Yeah. In Abbotsford. Hang on, Abbotsford. We are going to SNL Kitchen and Bar. And then I changed into my PJs. Kaljeet kind of changed as well. <laughs> I changed in the middle of Kaljeet's street. Yeah, like she did. I was like, yeah, in she my... was like butt nungy <laughs> on Kaljeet Street. No shame. Who cares? <laughs> it's people... okay. We was that just dog around. across the street was like barking at me though. And some guy came out to start his car. <laughs> I don't too. give a shit. Anyways, the camera's not focusing. Please focus. Okay, it's really dark. We're in the car, so the wait. On. Sorry if we're blurry. Oh, oh wow. Is that a flash behind me? <laughs> How does that help me? It oh. should be from here. Help you. Oh, is this here, better? Yeah. It's okay. No, it was fine before. <laughs> so anyways, SNL, the food is really good. And they have one in Abbotsford. That's the one we went to today. They have one in Langley. And then they're opening one in Selsery. So the food is really good. Our waitress sucked. No. The guy that made our drinks with the dreadlocks, I snapped. I mean, Please I vlogged him. He's so fine. He was so fine. He made our drinks. <laughs> what is happening? Yeah. There's like little dots. And uh -oh. You... 
Oh, it's like shit. It kind of looks cool. Oh my god. What? Oh yeah. Like, look. It's like it has nice. bubbles on top There's of me. There's like bubbles. <laughs> it's Poonam. She's just so bubbly and <laughs> kind. So bubbly and ratchet. <laughs> kind of like, uh, like Aliana says. Look, you're like glowing. So I don't no, get it. So this okay, light. Like this light is weird. Me. Whoa. Oh my god. Turn it off, Mona. Turn it off. Somebody what is stalking us. And then the hand comes out of nowhere. <laughs> okay, I don't know yeah, why the lighting in her car is like on. this. So anyways, I changed it to my PJs yeah. and now, you guys wanna see my minion PJs? Look at those minions on my PJs. They even have a, they even have a blue cuff at the bottom, they're very cute. Yeah, they're like minion leggings. So what are we doing now? Are we having dessert? No, we're gonna go by the bench, we're gonna enjoy With the view, bottle of wine. and we're gonna have Where's some Where's the force dessert? go? What is this fucking eating because you slept over? Are you eating that burger? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, guys, we were supposed to give Kojit's leftovers to like, a like, a, brother. like a homeless <laughs> or somebody. I was eating, eating it. <laughs> Where just the it? fries, just the fries, oh, it's okay. Did she pack the garlic mayo too? What the <laughs> Do you want it with your cake? <laughs> Yo, the waitress was so shitty, guys. She's oh so my god, let me I, we didn't even tell them about the ball. Yeah, so, the, the only reason I wanted spear, to go to SNL, spear. yeah, the only reason I wanted to go to SNL is because they have this dessert there called the chocolate spear. So, it was like that melting ball. Whoa, I'm glowing. I like that. Okay. Oh wow. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> so we went there for the chocolate spear. It like melts and then like it like e like erupts. It doesn't erupt actually. It explodes. It, it like evolves. yeah, it evolves into like a dessert. It <laughs> <laughs> so there was like a brownie with ice cream on it. Um, first of all, so it it like evolved. <laughs> And then she's like, oh, I'll be back with cutlery. Yo, this bitch didn't fry. come There's back. <laughs> For 10 minutes, all we did was sit the shower. 10 the minutes, she didn't come back. My ice cream was like melted. And to be honest, that dessert, it wasn't good. It was really shitty. So don't try it if you go there. Can you guys stop? <laughs> <laughs> KJ's getting wild in the back. No, no, this no, is what no. happens when you leave your husband for the weekend. <laughs> this girl almost took her ring off. Go Roger, back home! Roger, come back! <laughs> Roger, where are you? Moral of this whole this. story is don't get the chocolate sphere, even though it's like one of the few places that has it in Vancouver. Or And make sure yeah. they actually bring you spaces with it. It Otherwise, was so bad. Like you know, I saw these videos on Instagram of like cool looking dessert balls, so chocolate balls looking. that like melt. Pop. This one freaking sucked. It was yeah, awful. It it tasted like a but, shitty But our food was so good. Brownie. The Brussels sprouts were good. Yeah, the right. carrot fried ravioli. We had fried cauliflower. <laughs> um, Mine and Kaji's burgers were so good. We really was How was your fish? fish? We had sable, sable fish. Really good. So good. Sable portions so are big delicious. for the burgers. Oh, the burger is huge, so like share their it with someone. Their appetizers and their actual main courses are delicious, but it seems that their dessert isn't worth it. <laughs> Why does <laughs> this keep happening? Are you like an angel or something? Yeah, yeah. Oh, look at her. Look at her. <laughs> Okay, bye. <laughs> Is it this light? Should we turn? No, it it's fine. Okay. So we're gonna have dessert. Wait. Where did we Leg park? One. <laughs> so we're on Eagle Mountain, like at one of the higher. So points. we parked here. There's, There's a nice view. view. What do we got? <laughs> Come Someone in. Koji told me you were talking about it too once. I remember. No, I what? was. Money was. Um, okay. I told you about so it. So Duff and Cole like this, like this hipster bakery in Abbotsford. Oh, it's like. Is that where you got her birthday cake? No, 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 that was ready made. Oh, you know what? Right. We need to turn this light off. I waited like half an hour in line for this stuff, so I got some cake. For oh us. my god. Oh my I got god. Koji! I saw this Snapchat at first! <laughs> That's apple cinnamon. It's so cheesecake, good. <laughs> brown, is it now? And brownie cake. Wow. And the staff is like awesome there. It's so busy. Yeah, it's okay. I'm kidding. I'm not going to Snapchat, gonna Snapchat it. it. Another thing that I got was a <gasps> oh my box of fucking treats. Oh my god. Cinnamon bun. I don't even know what that is, but it freaking Jenny. looks good. Chitty Cherry tarts. Danish, lemon Danish, Could lemon you, bun. Can you please just play this? Like, like, I don't even need to say it. I feel like people will know what this is. <laughs> okay, bye. We're gonna eat. Yeah, yeah we can't really do I just keep staring.